So Michael Stout, great to see you over here in Hong Kong. You've got yep. two runners over here, C Moon and of course Carlton House. To your eye, how are the horses look? I think Carlton looks particularly well. Uh, he travelled extremely well. Uh, C Moon lost a little bit more weight than he did, but he seems to be picking up every day, so I hope by Sunday he will be all, all right. C Moon brings some great form with him from uh, his performances over in Europe this year, and uh, you must be delighted to have him over here. Yeah, yeah, we, we, we planned to come here for a long time. We also planned to take in the Breeders' Cup, but we cancelled that. We weren't quite happy with him just before shipment date for, um, for Santa Anita. So, uh, yeah, he's a fresh horse, and hopefully he'll, he'll perform well. He's, he's got good form. Strong field there in the Vars, and it looks to be not a lot of speed on. How would you like to see that race run from your perspective? He, well, he can use himself, and uh, he, he wouldn't want to get trapped in a, in a race when they were going too slow. He's a big, long striding horse, gets the trip well. Carlton House in the Cup, we saw him in the Derby a couple of years. He was competitive. Uh, well, it's a different type of horse, isn't he? Yeah, I mean, he's, he's a very consistent horse. He's a, he's an 8, 10 furlong horse. I think 10 is his, probably his very best trip. I think the form book says that. You know, his win in the Dante last year and this year, the second to see you then at Royal Ascot in the Prince of Wales. You know, they were probably his best two runs over 10 furlong. You're leaning either way towards one of yours being a better runner for Sunday? Well, you would have to say on the book, Seamoon has a better chance, you know. Best of luck for Sunday. Thanks.